Welcome to D Poetry and Inspiration with your host, author, and life coach, and poet, D Evans. Enjoy. Opinions. 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 Everyone has opinions and thoughts, perceptions of what it should be, of what they think it may be. Versus the reality of what it really is. Perceptions displayed, but perceived in a variety of different ways. We view things based on how we were raised. It will never be equality in the way we see things. No one will ever have the same mind or same view because we all are different when it comes to concept. But there is one way We can all be yoked and on the same accord within the same page of logical thinking, rational thinking. If we turn the page within the Bible, follow the laws, the commandments of what the Most High has set upon us, we have a chance to maybe view things the same. (laughs) But then again, that's still based off spiritual levels of knowledge and wisdom. Because even in that sense, we all don't have the same understanding. But we all know and understand the golden rules, which is keeping the commandments and the laws so we can live an eternal life. And not be living based off opinions, opinions from others, opinions from people who are in sin, according to the word of God and the scriptures and but it was revealed to us in prophecy. When we allow these opinions of others take control of us, it ruins our purpose, the alignments of who we were destined to be. But so we stay in one mind with the Most High God. Through the laws he put upon Moses' spirits and hearts to share with us the laws and commandments that's already supposed to be indulged in our hearts. We can endure and focus on the narrow path. The narrow path, because we are all subjected unto our own salvation. Therefore, the opinions of others holds no weights, the opinions of others spiritually is invalid 
Let's focus on the facts of life. Keep thou commandments of the Most High God so we can live. For that is the duty of man, not following the opinions of others.